Hello everyone and welcome to the Gotcha Weekend Update. I'm Wookie and I'm here to play some gotchas. Now what is the Gotcha Weekend Update? It is a series I do where every Sunday, and now I've decided it's every Sunday, I just play and relax with all the gotchas I play. Uh, today's going to be Dragalia Lost. Going into the Sobnock uh, raid. What? Okay. I was like, what do you even require, Sobnock? I'm completely done with the other event, by the way. So, yeah. Continue. There we go. Sobnock. Um, yeah, Dragalia. Waiting for the second year. Everyone's waiting for the second year. That's basically it. Everyone that's playing. There's going to be a whole bunch of changes coming. We'll see if that can uh, help with some of the situations we've got going on in Dragalia. Dragalia of Sword. What? What the fuck am I talking about? I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm very tired. Dragalia, though. Go in here. There we go. The thing was that someone was just choosing to skip. Ha! Oh, that's right. It's ha! The return of. I love this unit for one exact reason, it's because of that scream. I thought Ellie's scream was funny the first time, and it's only gotten funnier. Like, who cares about what, how her DPS is? What matters is... Ha! Ah! Ha! Ah! Oh, come on. Give me a ha to end this. I didn't even use Thor. Oh yeah, it's turning my time. What? Alright, on to the next gotcha, everyone. Pause. And here we are back with Dokkan. What's, what am I doing in Dokkan? There's no content for me to do because I ignore Super Battle Road. So all I've been doing is trying to raise the link levels for every single one of my Rayleigh's. Um, trying to get every single one of them to level 10. Why? Because I love her, of course. I love uh, Aurelia, I love Dr. Slump. Easily. Some of the best stuff Toriyama's ever made. What? Are you gonna fix yourself game there? No, okay. Uh, so yeah, that's all there is for me to do in Dokkan. So that's what I've been doing with Dokkan for the past. Basically since the celebration ended, I've gotten everything I wanted. Uh, God damn it. I don't buy stones. So I'm not one of those dudes who just can make 1,000 summon videos on I could probably make a thousand song videos on Dragalia. I cannot make a thousand on Dokkan. And Pete, some of them don't even make a thousand. It's like, what, maybe three a week or so. That's way too much, man. It's way too much money to give to Dokkan. Um, not to shame anyone, but, you know. You know. By the way, if you end up liking this, remember to please leave a like. Uh, comment about how you're feeling with your gotchas as well. I forgot to mention that at the stop. September is a very slow month for YouTube, I've learned. So, I've been kind of using this as a good time to relax. Um, so I've been just kind of like chill. You know, I know not a lot of people are going to leave likes and stuff because it's related to September. I don't know why it's specifically September and what it has to do with it, but that's just the way it is. So, you know, I understand. I fucked up. God damn it. Fuck me. I'm gonna have to ignore that freaking peel off too. That's annoying. It's very annoying. This all went south. The second I started asking for likes, man. That's how it be sometimes. Alright, Krillin. You'll also notice that this team is only designated to AoE a whole bunch. The reason is, I don't want to play this stage a whole bunch. So, I basically front load it with a bunch of AoE units um, to get them to level to try and get them to level 10, and then the rest of them are filled with units I actually legitimately want to get to level 10. With the exception of being the leader, who is, uh, Goku over here. Really, I could replace Goku with Aureli, because she is a 30% lead, and we don't need anything more than 100 and whatever percent, but... Eh. Eh, I say. Yeah, and this really is what link leveling is, by the way. It's just doing the same stage where there's a bunch of fights. It really sucks because all the fights, with the second you enter a stage, 
it's predetermined if your Link will level at a certain fight. So if you miss that fight, then they don't get Link leveled, but you don't know which fight. So your best bet on anything is to always pick fights um, that one you know are there. I think the, a lot of people just use the Raditz, but really? Come on, Dokkan, you're not even that uh, like action-packed. I don't know why the hell you keep losing connection. Jesus Christ, man. I'd understand if it was a game that required me to play, like, crazy active, but it's not. It's Dokkan Battle. Okay. There we go. That should be nice. Um, so that's kind of a bummer. That's what I don't like, for the most part, about the system. I think no matter what, it shouldn't be predetermined. It should be based on RNG on the stage you get. Because I have no idea if a stage is going to be a dud. So the idea that like that was a pre-planned dud makes it feel like I've wasted my time. Like, watch this one. That was a dud. I may as well have not fought it, but I had no idea that it was going to be a dud before it ended up being a dud. You know, big suck. But I hear a lot of people do the Raditz stage because that one has the most units. Um, I don't really care. I just know that this is also good for leveling you up. So I get to get myself leveled up, and everything works out for me. So... Simple. Clean. Majin Buu. X gonna give it to you. Fat Buu gonna give it to you. Pop Pop, open up the door, it's real. Man, so many deaths I'm- I've also killed a lot of Saiyo men. Enough to get the- I'm almost at the 15 the 1,500. And probably once I get that, I'll probably switch to which stage that has a lot of, um... Red Rocket? No, that's not what the name is. Red Ribbon, there you go. I was like, Red Rocket? No, that's something gross. Um... <laughs> it, uh, it was the, the Red Ribbon Army. What? How crazy would Dragon Ball be if it was called the Red Rocket Army? <laughs> Oh, if you don't know what the Red Rocket is, don't look it up. Watch the South Park episode with it, I guess. That'll explain it. That's what I thats what I think Red Rocket is. Oh, well, Red Rocket's also a name of a fast food chain. So they don't know that they've accidentally named themselves after that. Or is it Johnny Rockets? I don't think it's actually called... No, it was Red Robin and Johnny Rockets. Okay, two completely different things. Anyway, go into the last gotcha. And here's the final game. It's Fate Grand Order. Um... What am I doing in Fate? It's Lotto season, so I'm kind of grinding like a madman. Um, but currently, I'm actually not grinding like a madman. Um, because all I need to grind for this specific stage is burgers, and then once I get the burgers that I need, all I'm going to do is switch to daily stamina. And then once the final note is here, I'll grind the fries I need and the hot dogs, and then it's going to be all into the Lotto. Um, yeah, my lotto is, I think I'm currently at 20 boxes or so. Um, it's okay, and it's an okay amount. I'm gonna get way more- oh, god damn it! I forgot to do something. Alright, I basically just reset the phone for that. If you're wondering why I did it, it's because I completely forgot to do Ishtar's skill. Um, Ishtar has a skill that only activates the next turn. Not a lot of units have this kind of effect, because one, they're annoying. Um, but it gives her 50% attack and it has a cooldown of 3, so people say it's good. I still say it's kind of a bad skill. Specifically, the part where it says I have to wait a turn. I hate waiting a turn. Um, it is actually very good. I digress. Um, I just hate using it. So yeah, for this specific setup, if you remembered my last Fade video, I had Waver instead of, um, Scotty. The reason I switched to Scotty, it's faster. And I don't need, I don't need the, um... I don't need the attack buff up from uh, Waver in order for Ishtar to kill here. Usually, anyway. Um, Ishtar has a pretty good kill rate, from what I remember. She should be able to one-shot him right here, right now. I trust you so much, I'm not even going to give, you, give them a defense down. So here's the thing. There's about a... 10% chance that that Salter does not die. And if that Salter does not die, it's very unfortunate. Um, actually, it's not unfortunate. It's unfortunate, there's about a 10% chance that both of them don't die instantly from this shit. 
they both lived. God damn it. Yo, did you know you could reset a fight? Is this what I'm doing? God, really, the that little 10% chance that she does not do it. Maybe even less, and she fucking doesn't kill both of them. Oh my god. I fucking hate Ishtar. Especially since she has one 50% attack up. She has a fucking buster increase in her NP. She has 200% from a goddamn CE, and she cannot kill both of these bitches in one go. So unbelievably useless. One of the worst archers out there. I'm gonna say it right now. I don't give a fuck what anyone says. Ishtar, you are an unbelievable piece of shit. I'm not honored. You've brought dishonor on me. Dishonor on my cow. Dishonor on my video. You better have killed him one shot right there. She still didn't kill him one shot. Mm. Ishtar. I even did the Arjuna backstrat just to be sure. Man. Again, Ishtar is actually a very good unit. Ishtar just is stupid sometimes and she doesn't want to work. Ugh. God damn it, Ishtar. I hate you so much. I could do an entire video. I think you could actually make a highlight reel of all the times I've ever had to yell at Archer Ishtar. And her skills are level 10, too. See, I'm on 21. Uh, let me see my burger amount. Of course. <laughs> Not very much. So I only need... How am I going? I like talking to her. I like pressing the boobs here. So yeah, that's, the, that's today's Gotcha Weekend update, everyone. I hope you liked it. If you did, you can leave a like. Uh, I'll take you out to the smooth, smooth stylings of me just tapping on Sheba's boob nonstop. They really aimed this at the best spot possible. Just ta-da. Ta-da. Listen to her little sounds. Oh my god. The president will never suffer from this. That's the end of today's video, everyone. Have a good weekend. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.